My dad did not want me to be a stand-up comedian. He actually wanted me to be a stillborn. <laughs> uh, yeah, we get, we get on really well, actually. A great relationship. I'll actually tell you the nicest thing he ever said to me. So my dad fucking hates tattoos. He hates tattoos so much that I'm pretty sure he was gang-raped by a group of heavily tattooed men. That's how much he hates them. <laughs> so, the good son that I am, I've got a tattoo. Hey! Now, you're probably wondering, why? Well... <laughs> it's obvious, isn't it, really? Let's be honest. So, um, I'm thinking, right, how do I tell my dad that I've got a tattoo? And I'm thinking, and I'm thinking, and a week's passed. So I'm like, fucking hell, I can get away with this. Easily. Eight months later, and my dad still does not know. You're probably thinking, wow, that's, that's pretty impressive. No, I just wore t-shirts. But, um, <laughs> so at, at this point, I've got a family in Australia that I've never met, and they know I've got a tattoo. My dad still does not know I've got a tattoo. And then, something really weird happened, actually. My dad woke me up for work one morning. You're probably thinking, that's not that weird. Well, actually, some months he hardly spoke to me. <laughs> so, uh, this is what happened. <laughs> that's probably a bit dramatic. It was probably, it was probably more like this. <laughs> but that's not funny, is it? There's not many laughs there. So, for the sake of comedy, we'll, we'll make it dramatic, all right? This is how it went. Boom! I'm let, no laughs there. <laughs> okay, in that case, it was like this. I'm completely naked. I've got two options. I can cover my bits or cover my tits. I go for both. I'm like a fish out of water. I'm just flopping about. <laughs> Where am I? What's going on? What? My dad looks at me. Work. And walks away. He doesn't notice I've got a tattoo or my beautiful, beautiful penis. No. <laughs> I've got look at that and just leaves. So I'm thinking, fucking hell, I've got away with this. Two days later, my dad just turns to me and goes, Cole, have you got a tattoo? Oh, actually, yes, I have got a tattoo. I meant to tell you, sorry. Yes, I have got a tattoo. His face drops. You fucking idiot. You absolute bellend. You could have been anything you wanted to be and you just fucked it up. You could have been a doctor, a nurse, a politician, a model, a policeman. You could have been anything. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. My dad thought I could be a model. Yes. Yeah. But yeah, it's okay though. I've got my uh, brother to look up to, actually. He's taller than me. But as you've already witnessed, he's a bit of a bellend. So... Uh, so I apologise. So, uh, so recently in a job interview at a, a bar, and they asked him to give examples of customer service. Rape. <laughs> technically, technically he's not wrong. If I ordered a sandwich and got some rape, I'd probably be upset. Like you, you've come for some comedy. If you got some rape tonight. 